All right, over 50 food trucks and over 100 unique dishes, all prepared with the key ingredient. Bacon. That's what people will find this weekend at the second annual Bacon Fest. And News 13's David Romero, he is live at the Anderson and Brazil International Balloon Museum with a preview of all the greasy fun. David, I have to. <laughs> hey, Cassandra, you know what? I, uh, you know, since Matt's not here today, our, our boy Matt Morrow is out sick, and I feel I gotta make up for Matt and say, nom, 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 bacon. You know how Matt gets, loves to get animated with everything. God bless him. You know, we are inside, inside of uh, Greg Ritz uh, food truck right now, and this is one of the trucks that's going to be featured out here this weekend for the Southwest Bacon Fest. And uh, I'm going to take the camera off the tripod here. Good morning, Greg. Good morning. How are you doing? Oh, awesome. So, what do we have here this morning? What do we, what do we, uh, uh some of the items we're doing for the Bacon Fest? Uh, the one in the back here is a Southwest Bacon Egg Roll, it's uh, fire roasted corn, spinach, black beans cheddar cheese, and then we're serving it with a, a spicy chipotle dipping sauce. And of course with bacon, right? Of course with bacon. Uh -huh. um, this is a uh, pumpkin cheesecake cannoli with bacon in the pumpkin filling, and then I have a uh, homemade toasted pistachio bark, and then oh. the confectionery sugar. Um, this one is a green chili squash bisque, uh, hatch green chili, Wagner's Farm squash, with a uh, applewood bacon panko crumb. And then I also have some potatoes coming out of the oven. Piping hot fresh with, of course, bacon. And these are herb roasted russet potatoes with a bacon cheddar melt. Wow, that is incredible. So, I mean, it's, bacon is one of those dishes that, I mean, you can, or, or it goes with everything. There you go. It goes with bacon. You take the words out of my mouth because my mouth is watering just from everything here. So uh, these dishes right here, the ones that we're looking at on the wall, these are some of the things you're going to have prepared. The only one I don't have with me today, only because I'm, I want to bake it tonight fresh, I'm doing a, a zucchini cornbread with a sun-dried tomato bacon butter. Wow. So, so everything, everything has bacon, but some of them are a little lighter, so you're, you're able to enjoy many different uh, pieces. Well, I'll have you kind of walk back with me here. And, you know, so as we mentioned, there's going to be about 50 of the food trucks here preparing food everything. Food truck and restaurant. And vendors, restaurants. Yeah. So, guys, if you're looking for anything and everything bacon, um, I don't know what else we can tell you. This is the place to be this weekend. It's over here at the, uh, just on the east and north side of the Anderson Abruzzo International Bloom Museum. Uh, Greg, you're going to be one of the folks out here, right? We'll be here and many others. Incredible. Guys, come check it out. Southwest Bacon Fest, second annual this year. Back to you. Oh, my goodness, David. A pumpkin cheesecake bacon cannoli. Heaven. That's what it sounds like. All right. Thanks, David. For more information about the Bacon Fest coming up this weekend, head on over to our website, krqe.com.